Hey guys, how's everybody doing? As you can probably hear, I'm absolutely full of cold. I finally succumbed to everybody's limited colds they've been having. <laughs> well, it's coming out of me now. I, I don't think I'm going to suffer it for as long as everybody else because I've been absolutely adamant that I'm staying on my feet and being very positive about everything. And I, I've been watching everybody that's sort of really gone down hard with it. You know, I've been very sort of low or, or very moo about it. So. I think, yeah, being positive and, and upbeat really does help and really does work with a combination of, of eating the right foods and having the right attitude really does help keep you, you know, stronger. So, yeah, I'm on my feet and it's working. <laughs> it's working. Oh, my days. What a miserable day. Just come out to try and get some... Um, uh, throat sweets and bits and pieces. Do you know, I've been the only one who hasn't picked up this rotten head cold. Everybody around me has had this rotten head cold and I've been like swigging all my like honey, lemon and ginger drinks and making sure I have my rescue pack to hand, got on the steroids and antibiotics as soon as I started feeling a bit rough. You know, I've kept everything at bay nobody's <laughs> i did not pick up the head cold as much as i had a bit of a rough patch with my copd i certainly didn't have this head cold everybody's been going down with and what happens i succumb to it <laughs> as soon as i picked up i went straight back down with this head cold i thought right i'm not letting this beat me because i've really been watching everybody who's been suffering with it and the ones that are like sort of letting it get to them are really struggling with it and it's lasting longer and the people that are upbeat and positive and are really sort of like battling it off very quickly. And it is about how you feel and it is about how you act. And do you know what? I stayed as positive as I could. And I, you know, one of the days I decided that, you know, I really felt like I was gonna stay in bed. I thought, no, I'm not, you know, cause I know if I stay in bed, I'm gonna feel worse. Because you do get worse if you just like let it beat you. And I thought, no, get up don't feel like getting up but do it you know get someone help you get dressed and up and just get on with your day and I did and I felt fine but I <laughs> I've been going up down up down with it because you know I've been keeping it at bay I think being more upbeat and my body's like come on help <laughs> and I go down a bit then I pick up again but I really haven't gone down with it like everybody else and I do contribute that to being, you know, upbeat and positive and not letting things beat me and really fighting. And you have to fight, you know? And I love it. I don't I don't want it to be anything beating me. So anything, I'm not gonna fight and lay down and let anything beat me. But trust me guys, the positivity thing, right? I know I bang on about it and I know I drive people insane with positivity. But you know what? It bloody works. <laughs> Oh, I am, I am upbeat today. I don't know why. I've got this head cold that's driving me mad in my sinuses. You know when you... Oh, that's it. You blow your nose, but you can hear your ears squeak. <laughs> my ears are squeaking as I blow my nose. It's like, oh, my days are going on. <laughs> From me, catching the breath. Take care of yourselves and each other. And don't forget, stay positive, man. You know it works. <laughs> the proof is in the pudding. <laughs> See you later, guys. Bye. <laughs>